Welcome to another episode of the Bourbon Experience, and we're doing another episode of What's in the Glass. Don't you think it's gone on long enough? And this whole series is based on one of us buys a bottle, and the other, everyone else has to guess on what it is. And Alex actually already knows because he did the shopping. Down in Navarre, Florida. Yep. At Navarre Spirits. Thank yep. you for the uh, insight on the bottle. Yep. And so he texted me, said, are you interested? And I oh. said, yes, yes, I'll have that some. <laughs> so uh, anyway, so that's where we're at. Um, so we, uh, we want to get to it. Yeah. yeah. All right. So have a sniff and a drink. This is not your typical nose of a bourbon, I don't think. It doesn't. No, it, it, it's, it, it seems stronger. And Leon's getting larger. The, the nose seems. It does? Yeah. It's not like it's a higher proof. Now that, I don't know. That's oh. nice. Now I haven't, I haven't had any of this. This is the, this is our first time. I, I haven't had this one. No one's had this bottle. Right. Um, I have mm -hmm. not had, this is the first time I've had it. There's some big sugary fruits in that mm -hmm. nose. There really is. I, I almost wanted to say a, a lemon, but I don't. Um, no, it, it's darker than that. It's darker than that? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I'm get some light stuff in there. No, nah, I'm thinking like plums and peaches, pit pitted tree fruit type stuff. Okay. I don't know about peaches, but right. it's got legs. Yeah, if, if you if you like stew the peaches, it, it'll it'll give it those dark boulder flavors. Is that a garden belt for you? Uh, it's, it's I, got it's got nice legs. Yeah. All right, that's good. Cool. Yeah, it's sugar. Slap my ass and call me Sally. Well, slap my ass and call me Sally. <laughs> Boy, that scares me to death. <laughs> <laughs> that is really gross. At least he didn't say Sue. We'd have to wow. Out. I'll have a couple more sips of that. I'll slap your ass and call you slime. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm scared. <laughs> and and so I don't want to even hear about that it ever happened. <laughs> That's pretty tasty. It's different. This is a. This is not mm -hmm. your normal. Is this finished? It is not. I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> you know what the proof is? I do. Are you willing to? No. Is, is, is it uh, over 100? No. It isn't? No, no. That, that, yeah, that, it is not over uh -huh. 100. Have we had any from this distillery before? Yes. And have we been to the distillery? No. No. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Is it Kentucky? Yes. I guess that You're going to make me look up that distillery question, aren't you? Because they got bought up, so I'm trying to remember. No, we have not. I do know where it is. So no, we have not. Haven't been there. Um, no. Yes, we have not. <clears throat> that is nice. That's nice. Uh, it, it's very nice. Is it at a hundred? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so it's right at a hundred. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ooh, is it a bottle in a bottle? It is. Mm -hmm. Hey, you can be at 100 without being bottled in bottle. Oh, no. Yeah, that's, that's And true. it makes no difference one way or the other. Well, that nose translates over to the taste yeah, pretty does. well, doesn't it? It, it does. does. A nice taste on the back end, and then that translates in for the, tip, for, the, for the finish. The finish lasts for a while. That's nice. I think I finally have a way to describe what I'm smelling on the nose. That sugary, it, it's like a creme brulee. Mm -hmm. Creme brulee. So it's a little, little toasted. Smelling to okay. me, yeah, yeah, uh, just straight sugar toasted, and then so I see that, yeah, and it comes through on the taste too. Uh, yes, it does. Yeah, mm. 
Well, the the, <clears throat> the nose definitely comes through on the taste. Yeah. I mean, it, that that tr is def definitely translates. Hey, does the nose come through on the taste? I don't think so. Hey, you dish it out just as much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't. Never. It's, it, we ha I have it on video. <laughs> it, won't make, it won't make it to the cut, but when I got it on video. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's pull out our victim card. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a library card, but just update for 2023. <laughs> Well, I'm almost done, so would you guys hurry up? <laughs> Jeez. I haven't heard any guesses yet. Well, uh, you haven't. Do, do we have the, this uh, distiller in our, in our, any of the bottles other than that so far? Yes. Yes. You have one. I have one. Is it new real? No. It's two balls too short. <laughs> I know I messed that up. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Somebody just knocked the black thing off. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. So no, this is not new riff. And I don't I, I don't think it has anything we have we have a close to new riff. Yeah. We we've been to new riff, so yeah. Yeah. Well that's true. And it doesn't have any new riff flavors as far as I'm concerned. This is yeah. A little bit softer, I would say, yeah. you know, on the palate than the new riff. Yeah, I think you're right. <clears throat> I do like that nose. That's nice. It's, it's really, really good. Uh -huh. This was definitely a, a worthwhile purchase. Mm -hmm. So we have some of it on our shelves, mm -hmm. or he has. So, some of the same distiller. Yes. Right. Uh, yeah. Not some of this. I don't know if you do or not. You might, but I don't. I don't think he does. Yeah. Last time I saw this show. Okay. But that doesn't mean that I looked. And it's I'll changed both, a lot. That doesn't mean I looked in both your shelves either. He's been doing a lot of shopping. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> What? <laughs> your brain has the <laughs> Every, your brain has the shell on it. Every time I've gone shopping with or gone to the, the uh, booze store with these two guys, either one of them, they all sit. They both sit there and say, hmm, "What can I buy?" <laughs> I need your help. Where are you going? Shopping. And what the hell am I supposed to do? Uh, that's a different mind mentality than mine when I go in to buy something. I, I go in to buy that one, and I get it, and I'll leave. The only place in the world where I go shopping where I'm like, hmm, what can I do today? Yeah, right. And that's, <laughs> that's it. There, there's no, like, if, if I'm going grocery shopping, boom, 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 that's it, right? Yep. When it comes to bourbon, it's like, ooh, I could go get this one, right? Because it takes, some, it's important enough to take some thought into what you're getting, right, and, and spend your money wisely accordingly. We're just spending money. money. <laughs> Otherwise, it's just groceries and clothes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, we got this, 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 this does not smell beamish. Um, and I'd be shocked if it. Well, no, it can't be Makers because we've been there. Yeah, and it's definitely not in the Makers profile. I don't yeah. know. Yeah, no, I, I would agree. And Makers doesn't make a bottle of bond. This is true. Yeah. Hmm. I didn't know that. They make a 101, but they don't make a bottle of bond. And tasting the 101, which I just finished off because I use it for, and it's actually, the 101 was actually pretty good for an old fashioned, um, but other than that, I'm, you know, they should go, they should buy invest in doing a bottle and bond instead. <laughs> <laughs> do you have any of it on your shelf back here at San Distillery? I do. You can cheat if you want and look oh, back. Oh, cheat. And look back. Thanks. <laughs> no way. Yeah. <laughs> Because he's looking at bottle shape as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 1792. Yeah, boy! 1792. Bottled and bond. 
store picks. Store oh, pick. wow. so, so it's a little extra, but a little so extra on that. The bottom bond, seventy nine two. Which that alone was gonna be for <laughs> us. Like we've been looking for that period, and then it's the single barrel. Uh, so it's their fusion. That, that's is that the name of the the store? I think it's the name of the parent company of us. Uh, okay, so it's Navarre Spirits. So. Okay, so fusion fine wine and or spirits. Navarre liquors. Um, but oh, we yeah. that that yeah that. Huh. Now, now that now that I know in 1792 it is a distinct. It, does, it does, does taste. Well, uh, yeah. 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 One second here. Uh, yeah. So I mean that's just this is something we've been we've been looking just with, and I've heard really good things on just the bottled and bond mm -hmm. and uh, you know we've been we've been hunting for it and yeah. and when Alex texted me and he was like hey you you want me to get this I'm like yes sir <laughs> <laughs> well I knew it was one of your one of your personal unicorns yeah and, uh, and we've all been wanting to try yeah. it in the first place because we have, we like the regular 1792. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I've never seen any other 1792 before on the shelf. Yeah. Even when we've been down to Kentucky. We didn't, yeah, we have not. Yeah, Yeah. well, well the yeah. other one's 93.7. Oh, was that 93? Yeah. Where is it? But when, so I, when, I, was, when, I, so when I was down there. Oh, yeah. I got it. Okay. When I was down there, I, I, got just, I, I walked in there and I said, I'm from Ohio, I was just kind of looking for something local that I might, might have been able to purchase that was like distilled and all of that in Florida, so I, was, I, I kind of thought that would be kind of a cool bottle to bring back. Yeah. And uh, and she's like, oh, you're from Ohio? And I'm like, yeah, and she talked about the fact that we're a little bit state controlled and don't always get all the, the nice bottles that we can. Yeah. And she said, well, this is one of our best sellers here, and pointed right at that bottle, and I just said, put that on the table. <laughs> <laughs> and then I texted him. Yeah. And so. I walked around and looked at other things, and I, and I went, okay, I get, but I don't have the mic for the app. I need to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> so how much did the bottle run? 60. So yeah, uh, 59.99 plus yeah. tax. So. And, yeah. what, and I, what was uh, the 93.7? The Ninety-five point seven. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because the other one's bought. Right. It's like thirty-five bucks. I think. Thirty-five. Yeah. So it's about yeah. double. Uh, and it's worth it. <laughs> yeah. Um, it, yeah. That, that is, I, that's nice. It, and it's so doing, doing a direct comparison from memory. It's not even close. Yeah. This is just. It's super smooth, isn't it? Mm -hmm. this, this is a heater right down the path that you can't catch up to. But. But this is this is a good bottle. We oh, all like yeah. this. This is mm -hmm. a good bottle. I, 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 I prefer the whiskey itself. Why are you the way that you are? Honestly, every time I try to do something fun or exciting, you make it not that way. All right, well, there you go. So, hey, uh, so for this one, uh, we have the, the 19th or 1792 Bottle and Bond. Thank you, Alex, for... Yeah, you know, communicating, uh, letting letting us know, get it. And, yeah. uh, this that, that this is this is a good one. So, yeah, top so, notch. Top notch. So if you can find yes. a bottle of bottle and bond, or you've had their bottle and bond, hey, come make comments on it because this is the first time. If the regular bottle and bond, that's not the store pick, is is good, I'd like to know that too. I wouldn't mind doing that, trying to find that and have a comparison, but we yeah. just can't find it. It'd be interesting. I hate to be disappointed now, but yeah. <laughs> but we just can't find it. I I can. Yeah. Small batch a year ago was hard to find. Yeah, it's right. starting to come out a little bit more, but we can't find any of the other stuff. Yeah. You know, uh, I have not seen anything else from 1792. Yeah, I see 1792 yeah. on the shelf all the time now. now and now, but yeah. yeah, I mean, I went to Indiana and got that bottle and was like, you know, and I got two of them and thought that was like a huge deal. And it was a small batch, you know. So well, there you go. But anyways, yeah. okay. Uh, well, hey, thanks a lot for tuning in. We're having a good time with it. Appreciate it. For all bourbon. Have a great one, guys. We'll see you later.